Good morning and welcome to Killin in Scotland. The first morning of our Scotland tour. Carol's still in bed. But I thought I'd come and show you this for a start. This is the waterfalls here in Killin. They look fantastic. Ooh, slippy. Mizzling with rain a little bit this morning, but uh, what do you expect? It's Scotland. We're with our friends, Andy and Sandra. They're all still in bed. I've come out for a uh, quick walk down to uh, the falls here. What do you think to the view? Let you have a look over the other side. Right, well we're up, we're up here for seven days, so hoping to bring you some great riding on the motorbikes and some fabulous scenery. So hope you'll want to come along with us. Mine's not starting. Is it not? Kill switch. <laughs> Kill switch. At least I need to check it now. Okay. And uh, it's a late start for us today. Very experimental setup as well, filming just one camera. We've got the 360 going in um, just single lens mode, and uh, hopefully, we've got Carol connected. Are you there, Hello. Carol? Hello. Uh, hello, hello, hello. And with us today in front, in front of Carol is Sandra, and in front of Sandra is our uh, mate Andy. Andy's tour leader today. As we had got loads of routes planned, but uh, we've got a late start because it was uh, a bit misty and rainy first thing. So it's, uh, it's half eleven now, so it's a late start. So we're doing a doing a short run from Killin to Inverary. So if you'd like to come along with us, that's just great. Got a few bikers here already. How do you pronounce these falls, Carol? Dockhart, I think. Dockhart Falls, yes. It's busier than the word this first thing this morning when I came down. Yeah. Thank you. Beautiful now. I've even got my Venti gear on, which is a first for Scotland. It definitely is a first for Scotland. It is definitely a first for Scotland, yeah. But have you ever bought it here before, have you? I think if you're on tour here, it's uh, very unusual that you come with a Venti jacket. But we're lucky enough to have uh, driven up the water bikes up from uh, from the Midlands in the uh, in the van. And uh, we've uh, got every conceivable different combination, haven't we, in there for, for the weather. So, hopefully, anyway. Oh, Scotland looks great when the uh, sun's out, doesn't it? Oh, it's beautiful. Nowhere better. I've always said Scotland is the best place to ride if you yeah. can get the weather. Yeah. So, you've got these little chevrons on the yeah. road, so I'm guessing it's something to do with them. Is that where a motorcycle should be, its position for going around that corner? <laughs> I don't know, is it the racing line? If you're in the middle of... No, he's trying to tell you. Is it trying to tell you where to go? I don't know. Oh, blimey. That really is a bit nanny sure. statish, isn't it? If you're trying to tell you your road position for a corner. It does here, you need to... Yeah, it's another, it's another one of those signs. I think it means drive in the middle of the chevron. So let's see a chevron and see if I agree with where the chevrons are placed. <laughs> oh, there. Yeah, they there. are there. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. That's yeah, fine. it is. It's trying to get you set up to the left of that corner so you yeah. don't clip it. Yeah. And then you'd, you'd normally come out again towards the centre line, wouldn't you? Yeah, they don't give you chevrons there. Uh, it's not encouraging <laughs> you to, to, to do the central line bit. It's like uh, bike training, then. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit, it's just a bit nanny state though, isn't it? Blimey. Never seen that before. Shouldn't anyway. really be on the road though, unless you've got an idea of road position, should you? <laughs> I would have thought so, but well, we're, we're, not, we're not putting ourselves up here as uh, legal eagles or experts. <laughs> We've uh, never took an advanced day's training in our lives, unfortunately. Oh no, there's a car caravan coming. Oh, it's going left. Whew. It's more like it. Look at that view. Oh, fabulous view, isn't it? Absolutely fabulous. This is what we're here for, guys. This is the A82. Another thing that surprised us in the last uh, couple of years up here, uh, like most of the residential areas have gone to 20 miles an hour, haven't they? Yeah. Yeah, we noticed that when we were staying in Northumberland, didn't we? Yeah, Everywhere surprising. in Scotland. All the Scottish towns have gone to 20. It's like a double crash barrier to stop you going over just there. You'd go straight in, wouldn't you? And get wet. <laughs> so this road goes right the way along the edge of the lock with the look of the uh, sat nav. Temporary 24 miles. Oh, look at that. Look at that. so well mm. as it gives you a minute to take the view in doesn't it it does might be trying to cure that landslip problem see all the nets on the uh, hillside up there look mm. it's sure got to be an issue hasn't it Places to be stuck in traffic, waiting. It's stunning, isn't it? Look at that view. It is amazing. See the clouds just coming up over the mm. top there. Yeah, beautiful. I wonder if that parking up there at the top is that uh, rest and be thankful parking space. Looks down the valley. Might be. Definitely don't want to get caught at a red again. No. Ah, let's we'll see what they're fixing. I'm betting it's landsliding. Yeah. Looks like it's where they've got all those chains look holding it back. Yeah. You don't want a boulder flying down uh, the mountain at you, would you? Yeah. Where all the streams are, isn't it? So all streams obviously get overloaded. Yeah. Bring down bits. They're definitely fixing something. Mm. It doesn't look like a quick fix to me. No. The little road took down there to the left. Look. Yeah, you see, I think that's the old military road, that spot uh, Andy was talking about, that ah. can go down when this road's closed. But um, I think that is the uh, rest and be thankful car park, whether we'll uh -huh, stop there uh -huh. to get a picky or not, I don't know. It's supposed to be a good view down that way. There you are, look.
just kind of first two guys sat on the bench looking at it. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Got to be done. <laughs> <laughs> You're fine there. I'll crop you. I'd make I'll crop move you out. How are you? You've moved. <laughs> oh dear. Whew, what a view, eh? What a view. Oh, I've got to paddle back now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm facing yeah. downhill. I to send everybody down and push me back out. You've got to be kidding, aren't you? Holy shit. This is nice tarmac and not gravel. It's a good job I've got long legs. Hell, fire. <laughs> it's steep here. <laughs> Will the Insta battery alas to Inverary? That uh, is the big question. Ah, Brother. there you are. North. Thunder's up back. Oh, it's just getting nicer and nicer weather all the time, Carol. Mm hmm. that. Mm, that's better, isn't it? Oh, magnificent.